Hi you guys, so today I'm going to be doing a request and then I'll be doing some more fun place up videos today, I promise. Um, how to organize your yarn. By, this was requested by Angelic212. The reason she requested this is because she doesn't use embroidery floss. Um, she uses you know yarn which is totally fine I just real I just think it's a little bit more chunky but yes I like it doesn't annoy me um sh this is what she said I have a question how can I organize my yarn because I do friendship voices with yarn do you recommend yarn for friendship voices can you make a video on how to organize your yarn please okay I don't use um, yarn anymore. I used to, so it's really just what you like. Some people love to use love to use craft thread. Other people love to use embroidery floss. It's just really your style. But my brother sews, and don't laugh at that, um, there's nothing wrong with him, he's actually really good at sewing. It's just a hobby he has, so please don't make fun of that. But, this is what you get yarn like, right? This is what you, how you should organize it. So, if you're lucky, you will have a good yarn. A good yarn store in your area. And what you can do is you can take this to them and they'll wrap it into a ball. Because this is what you want, is a ball. It's just easier to use and it's smaller. And this is what you have to use when you knit. Um, and it just saves space. And that how is how I would organize it. So I'm going to be showing you how you guys can make a ball. But I'm not going to do the whole thing because this is my brother's. And I don't want him to get mad when he comes back from college. Okay. So. You can either get a nice fashionable once you put it into the balls, what I do to organize it is you can either get a fashionable um, container or not. You know, like a basket. I just have this one. Well, my brother just has this one. It's plastic. Nothing special, you know. Um, and what you can do is obviously he started knitting um, something. So obviously you probably wouldn't have this fuzzy stuff, but he does. He started knitting this. And um, you wouldn't have this because that doesn't work with um, stuff, but you could fit about 20 or more of these smaller sized ones, 10 of these big ones. So really, um, it just matters um, if you want two different balls, three different balls out of one big thing. So yeah, this is what I my brother does, and this is what I would do. And tune in for the next video that is coming up right after this on how to actually put it into a ball, because I've done it multiple times. And yeah. So yeah, I hope this helped Angel 212 and tune in for the next one. Okay, bye.